coffee, the magical brew that powers our mornings, fuels our late nights, and keeps us going when we're on the edge of exhaustion. I thought I just needed a night's sleep, but it's... It's more than that. But what if I told you that this everyday pick-me-up could also be deadly? That's right. In the wrong dose, coffee can kill you. And in 2019, it actually did. In 2019, Tom Mansfield, a young, healthy personal trainer from Wales, made a simple mistake that cost him his life. A mistake many of us could easily make if we're not careful. Today, we're diving into how a small miscalculation in coffee powder cost him everything. It started as just another day. Tom was a fitness enthusiast who, like many others, relied on caffeine to boost his workouts and keep his energy levels up. But instead of grabbing a cup of regular coffee, Tom decided to use caffeine powder. One scoop, and he'd be on his way to an energized workout. Caffeine powder is incredibly potent. We're talking up to 200 times stronger than your average cup of coffee. But instead of carefully measuring the recommended dose, which is only about 60 to 200 milligrams, Tom accidentally scooped out several grams. To put it into perspective, the average person consumes about 100 milligrams of caffeine in a cup of coffee. Tom unknowingly consumed more than 5 grams, equivalent to drinking over 50 cups of coffee all at once. Now here's where things get dangerous. Once caffeine enters your bloodstream, it stimulates your central nervous system, giving you that buzz, that boost in alertness. But too much of it, it's like sending your body into overdrive. Within minutes, Tom's heart began to race. He felt jittery, anxious. What started as a simple caffeine boost turned into a full-blown overdose. His pulse skyrocketed, his body temperature spiked, and soon, he began to collapse. Excessive caffeine can cause heart palpitations, seizures, and ultimately cardiac arrest. In Tom's case, his heart couldn't handle the overload of caffeine, leading to a fatal heart attack. Tom was just 29 years old, a father, a husband, and full of life. But in an instant, everything changed all because of a miscalculated dose of caffeine powder. So how exactly does caffeine kill? When you consume too much, it overstimulates your central nervous system. Your heart beats too fast, your muscles tremble uncontrollably, and in severe cases, your heart can simply give out. In fact, as little as 10 grams of caffeine around 100 cups of coffee can be fatal for most people. But with caffeine powder, just one small mistake can push you beyond that limit. Now we're not saying you should throw out your coffee beans just yet. For most people, drinking coffee in moderation is perfectly safe. In fact, it can have health benefits, improving focus, boosting metabolism, and even protecting against certain diseases. But caffeine, like many things, is best enjoyed in moderation. Too much of it, especially in its purest form, can turn deadly. So, next time you reach for that second or third cup, or if you ever consider using caffeine supplements, remember Tom's story. It's a tragic reminder that more isn't always better. Before you go, we'd love to hear from you. Do you rely on coffee to get through the day? How much caffeine do you think is too much? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And hey, if you found this story eye-opening, give this video a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and hit that subscribe button to join the Perspective family. We've got plenty more fascinating stories and life-saving facts just like this one. Stay caffeinated but stay safe. Thanks for watching and remember, one scoop could change everything.